Have you ever found yourself stuck trying to figure out how to create a predicate from a custom list of predicates in Java? It can be a bit confusing, right? If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're going to break it down step by step. I totally get it. Diving into programming can feel overwhelming, especially when you're trying to piece together concepts from different sources. You're not alone in this. Many new programmers face similar challenges. Let's take a look at the specific question at hand. One user recently asked, how do I make a predicate from a custom list of predicates in Java? They shared a code snippet and wondered if their solution was good or if there was a better way to approach this. Sound familiar? Let's explore this together. So what exactly is a predicate in Java? A predicate is a functional interface that represents a single argument function that returns a Boolean value. In this case, you're trying to create a that combines and binds multiple predicates. Let's break down the user's code to understand it better. And stick around. By the end of this video, you'll not only understand how to create your custom predicate, but also learn some best practices that can make your code cleaner and more efficient. To create a predicate from a custom list of predicates, the user should first ensure they have a list to store these predicates. This can be done using an array list. Next, the user needs to implement a method to add new predicates to this list. This method should check if the list is initialized and then add the new predicate. Now the user should create a method that combines all the predicates in the list into a single predicate. This can be achieved using the stream API to check if all predicates match the input. Finally, the user can test their implementation by adding some sample predicates and using the combined predicate to evaluate different strings. Fun fact, the concept of functional programming, which includes predicates, has roots that go back to the 1930s. It's amazing how these ideas have evolved and are now a fundamental part of modern programming languages like Java. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative approach suggested by another user involves using the built-in AND function of the Java predicate. This function allows you to combine multiple predicates into one. You can create a new predicate that evaluates the conditions of all included predicates. Here's a pro tip. Always test your predicates with various inputs to ensure they behave as expected. This will save you a lot of headaches down the line. And there you have it. You've learned how to create a predicate from a custom list of predicates in Java. Remember, practice makes perfect. If you found this video helpful, hit that subscribe button for more programming tips and tricks.